Hey everyone, I made my own sanding block by cutting a, but maybe an eight inch piece of two by four and then stapling some sanding paper on top of it. I'm gonna use this to uh, grind down the overlay where the fiberglass is, just so I can have a straight line. I can try trial fitting uh, the elevator next to the fins here. So I'm gonna start grinding and see how it goes. Been grinding away for a while and you can see that line looks really nice and, and smooth now across. Um, and uh, just been slowly taking out more and more of the fiberglass. Um, also, when I do this, I always wear a 3M mask, like this guy right here, just because I don't want to breathe those fibers in, because that can really, really hurt your lungs over time. But I'm going to go ahead and uh, try trial fitting this, just to see how it works, and uh, pop a, a, a makeshift pin in there just for a minute to see how it looks. So I'll try that in a second. Okay, the pin is pretty far in there, only about two, or three or so inches off from going all the way through. Uh, and the, the, this is a short pin, I think it only goes to about here. But you can see the trial fitting, this is pretty snug. Um, I need to, to get some more of the fiberglass off the bottom, but off the top, when I bring the tip next to it, it is pretty dead on accurate. Uh, what I think we're going to do, because this is, um, it feels like it's rubbing aluminum on aluminum, so what I'm probably going to do is take this Clico out, kick this over until it's not rubbing, and then re-drill the hole into the fiberglass, uh, probably in the 30 size, so that way it'll be more permanent, but I'll make sure there's no contact. You're supposed to keep a minimum of an eighth inch between these two surfaces. I mean, the closer they are, the... Um, the, uh, the less drag because there's less air slipping through, but you also want to make sure you don't get a chance to have icing lock it up or, um, you know, when this flexes because of uh, going fast, you don't want it to, to bind itself either. So you want to make sure you stay within the design parameters. But um, it's uh, looking pretty good though. Still uh, trucking away and on, I'll see how it goes. But I just wanted to test fit it for right now and uh, see how it looked. Uh, once I get this part finished, I'll go ahead and um, drill the rest of these holes and then I'll go mirror and finish this side as well too because that one still needs to be finished uh, getting all the fiberglass off. But that's it for now. Thanks for watching.